So let's talk about the teachable digital downloads. You can turn files such as eBooks, presentations, and templates into products for students to download. If you would like to follow along, I will leave my link down below. And if you click that, you can actually try out teachable for free. So here we're gonna get going after we go to choose a new product, there should be a button at the top right. Let's click on digital download here. So let's go through some of the basics here. Product name, pretty self-explanatory. Allow me to add that in. All right, so we have the Affiliate Blueprint Quick Start. We have our category. So this is going to be an ebook for this description, optional, but we'll throw it in. So here I will show you the biggest steps for the process, allowing you to get up and running very quickly. We have a thumbnail. It's optional. You know, obviously you can put that there. I'm just going to skip that for now. Content you can upgrade if you want to access dozens of additional files, including zip files and unlimited number of files per product. For this, I have basic, so I'm just going to utilize this. I'm going to upload my PDF file. One second. All right, we have our Affiliate Blueprint right there. Let's click on Upload. All right, next we have product visibility. You can hide or show your published digital product on all the products pages of your school site. So this probably won't show up if you don't have a ton of them. So that's how that's going to be. Just keep that like it is. And if you ever want to delete it, here's going to be the button for it. So let's go back up and click on save. Perfect. Now there's going to be a few options that you can utilize. I will actually just preview so you can see there shouldn't be too much going on here. As you can see, this is going to be the download. Here, we're going to show you the biggest steps. Pretty much everything that we went over. Not a whole lot going on there, which is completely fine. Let's go back. What else I want to do is go over the pricing. So here we can edit whether we want it to be free or paid. So let's click on Add Pricing Plan. Okay, so we can do free, allow access to your content free of charge. You have a one-time purchase or a payment plan. So let's just say we wanted to do a one-time purchase. We can go here with that. So let's just do $7.00. All right, so we have $7 with the Affiliate Blueprint Fast Track Guide, whatever it was called, right? We have a subtitle here, Get Up and Running with Affiliate Marketing Half the Time. And of course, we have some typos right there that we can add in there. So I'm just going to click on Add Pricing Plan. Okay, we can also add a coupon code. However, I'm going to do separate uh, specific videos for that. What's great about Teachable is that not only do they have coupon codes, they have order bumps as well. There's the option for upsells and so on and so forth. And that's going to be how we can actually utilize the uh, pricing plan for that. We can also do free. I'm going to copy this and let's just uh, paste this in here. Okay. And we have our pretty standard checkout, which, you know, looks clean. I like that. We can change this around a little based upon, you know, how you set up your theme, what your logo is. And this, of course, you'd probably want to add some type of picture there, make it look a little bit more spiffier, but uh, I just quickly glanced over that. So that's where that picture would go uh, if you needed to edit that. So going back over here, that's a very quick tutorial about how you can set up the uh, teachable digital downloads. Of course, I'm going to be doing more separate videos when it comes to kind of polishing up the sales page and more things like that, that you can kind of combine to make it look obviously spiffy and more presentable so you can help get some more sales. But very quick and easy when it comes to getting your digital downloads up. In the next video or in one of the fewer videos coming forward, I'm going to show you how to upload a course step by step so you can see that process. It's probably going to be one of the most popular videos because that's the main overview of Teachable is right for courses. Aside from that, you got the digital downloads and coaching, but I hope this quick tutorial helped you out and answer some questions. If you want to check out Teachable, my link will be down below in the description where you can try them for free. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.